Hey guys, welcome back. We are continuing our journey through Final Fantasy VII, and uh, let's just double check what's going down with this stuff. I think we've got the dragon armlet there. Oh, look at that, that's badass. Um, yeah, let's get that to her. To, to Tifa. And let's move around some materia. Oh, because they freaking stripped Eris of Aura stuff now, look. If you do an exchange, look, Eris is gone. Yeah, she's gone. So, um, yeah, let's sort all this out. Is it all like normal? She's all got, she's got another weapon, actually, as well. Yeah, work glove. Oh my god, Paris. That work glove, look at that. It's hard, but there's no freaking slots to it. Um, cool, let's sort her out. We give her gear, give her restore, strap, time, gravity, mini. Let's give her added effect of ice. Skill back. Restore and all. Earth and all. Give her a sense. Direction. What else you got going on here? Odin and Shiva. Cool. Who's got manipulate? Barrett. Barrett, mate, you've like, got nothing on here, man. Let's give you some other stuff. Meh. You're all good. So let's just save those jams a second. So, uh, yeah, next up we got to try and find a uh, friggin... harp to get into the next bit but first I'm gonna go straight in there because if you go in there it just it's an endless loop loopy loop of things so um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do this so I'm gonna try and find that material first so you gotta keep an eye on the screen you gotta kind of like keep an eye on the screen because you see a falling bit of material like here I think there it is, got it. Bang, straight away. Sometimes you gotta go up and down the screen quite a few times to get, get yourself a little bit lost, but uh, bang, got it straight away. I wonder, because you've got Tifa here, you got added effect, adds material status to equipment or, or armor, so she's got ice. Maybe I should switch that around. Uh, material. Arrange. Arrange. Like Tifa should have like... And then that will make the status of her... Oops. That's why I don't mess about with like, this added effect stuff. Because uh, I think sometimes I don't get it. Status, Tifa. Now she can attack with ice. So I wonder if I give her this. I wonder if I give her this. Um, this guy here. He does. He's. He does like three different elements. No, not at all. All right, fair enough. He does fire, ice, and uh, lightning. Let's not mess about with that anymore. Do, 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 
So, we can now try and get this harp. we got to try and uh, talk to this guy. The lunar harp is somewhere in the ground here. Uh, start digging. Uh, just the lunar harp, please. Alright then. Uh, dig. Please push square button to set our staff into position. Okay, cool. So I'm going to put one dude here. And put one dude here. I'm gonna put. I don't, I, don't know, I don't know if there's ever a good strategy for this. Kind of just kind of go a bit bananas. Put one dude here. I don't, yeah, I never really quite figured out what the jam is of this. If there's like a really good way of doing it, or is it just dumb luck? Never could quite figure it out. And I'll put one more here. So I've kind of like spread them all out. I think you can do a maximum of five. Yeah. Uh, let's do a night bomb for search. Go. Each staff member will calculate the tremors and face the buried item. In other words, the point where the staff line of vision meets the dig point. All right, cool. So she's flipped. Select the dig point by moving the uh, square point and pressing the square button. The staff will dig and search for an item. Uh, here. There you go. Now the staff will dig here. The result of the dig will be placed in the Tang treasure box overnight. I don't get so they, they ask you to put. I'm, I'm thinking in my head like you you dot all your staff around and they dig up to that point. But they don't. I think they just dig in that one particular point. And it got... Ah, oh, I got it in one. That's crazy. I didn't think I would ever get in one. There were times where I've done it in like five or six attempts. It's ridiculous. But I'm glad I did it in one for the bloody Let's Play sake. Ugh, my God. That was easy than I thought. There we go. Yeah, I don't know if I did it right then or not, but... Here we go. I forked out a lot of money for those diggers, so I would have thought better, better if bloody done it in one. I'm gonna sleep as far as awoke. So normally, if you were to go in this point without the heart, it would just you just keep going and going and going and going like a kind of like a uh, think of Legend of Zelda. Man, it's so weird being in this point now because this this is like the uh, crossover point between this one and two. So um, yeah, we're getting there. A water ring that's gonna come useful, especially for Aqualung. Aqualung is going to be the badass move that we like. I like, I like, I like, I need for um, uh, my enemy skills jams. That's going to be good. So, yeah, what's our next goal next then as far as leveling up is concerned? We need Cloud and Barrett to murder people so they can get their level 3 le limit breakers. Just flat out kill people. So maybe I should like, um. Put the enemy skill that T forgot on Barrett instead. Oh. Nice. Because th that could have gone to Barrett. Take three kills. In fact, I will do that. God, Tifa isn't far behind, is she, with the levels? She missed out on the, the temple, but she's still up, up there. Um, if, I will do that. Arrange, exchange. I'm going to give manipulate to Barrett. To Tifa, sorry. 
Barrett, mate, you need more jams, man. You need more jams in your in your jam face. Wasted slots here, mate. Guess we could just transform and then. I don't want to just like add stuff just for the sake of adding it because I don't think I would use it. I'll just keep it like that. I don't know what I don't know what added effect would do with transform. Yeah, there you go. Uh, that's quite cool. That's quite cool. Yeah, let's keep that then. Um, so your added effect onto transform, so it stops him from turning into a frog or being small. Nice. Ooh, I always thought that was cool. A sort of transition there. There is another enemy skill in this area as well. It's right next to where the save point is. So, um, oh, we're in a world map. Gives me a chance to save my jams. Oops! Oops! My microphone keeps falling. Bum 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 bum. Here we go. Bum 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 bum. I forget where I need to go. I think it's. Do I just go straight up? I can't remember. I think I need to go left. Let's start with the left. Work our way to the right. Yeah. I think there's a safe one here. Yeah, there is. Press this glowy, glowy thing. I think I can press that glowy, glowy thing. I can't. Oh! Words of the ancients. No good. I can't understand. Speak louder. I will save here just because, you know, it'd be rude not to. Uh, yeah, so I can't remember. I know this area, we come back here again. When, um, in this 2, with, um, what's his face? The, the elder gentleman from Cosmo Canyon. So, we won't get too excited just yet. I think this is what his area is here. I think there is a bit of an item around here somewhere. I don't think there's any enemies or anything either. There's no random battles. The aura and the... We're getting some pretty cool stuff. Do I want that? Then I lose a uh, lose something. Yeah, give it to me. Um, I was gonna say um, absorb ice. Nice. So ice. Ice attacks are not on our, our thing. It was interesting as well, it's like we've got status here. I don't think we ever do any water attacks. There's no like there's no like material. You've got fire, ice, lightning. There's no water attacks. No like material for water. Really weird. But um I don't think we do anything in this part yet. No, not at all. So, yeah, I always find that strange. There's no water attacks. No water, water, water attacks. What we do. So the only way you can actually do it is if you get an enemy skill, I believe. I might be wrong. Hopefully, he's, maybe I've just missed out on something for all this time. I don't think... If I go up, I think... We just go to a, a lake or something. Lots of running around. Uh, 
the podium. Yeah, I don't think we need to be here. I don't think there's any items to get as well. I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Ooh, maybe I'm wrong. I think there is a material up there. There is. Nice. Comet. So there's no... <laughs> there isn't a... Uh, is Comet a pretty good material to have? I can't remember. Nah, I'll pass for now. But, um... I was going to say... I think we're just literally exploring this at the moment. Bum 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 yeah. So it's taken us roughly 40 episodes, 40 odd episodes to get to get to the end to this area, end of the, near the end of this one, which is pretty good going really. It's gonna be definitely be a I think it's definitely gonna be a triple digit playthrough. <laughs> it's gonna be cool. I'm enjoying it. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Uh, I've released the first ten episodes on my YouTube channel and it's going okay. I like to think. So, uh, yeah. there's some beds somewhere. And next to the beds are um, enemy scale material. And I would very much like to have that equipped. I think we literally just rest and then like that's it. Elixir. Up we go. And we're just gonna go over here and it's gonna be like, oh, beds. Let's use the beds. Yeah, beds. Shall we take a break here? Let's do it. Uh, no. Because. Look at that! Enemy scale, nicely done, nicely done. Materia, who needs it? I gave it to. We don't need anything to manipulate just yet. Whack that on straight away. I do appreciate it. Do I need to go in and out again? There's no enemies to. Uh, yes, yet, but the next battle that we're gonna go into. There is an enemy skill to learn straight away, so, yeah. Mm. I feel it. Clyde, what is it? Eris is here, and so is Sephiroth. What? Sephiroth? But how can you tell? It's not an excuse. I feel it in my soul. Then we better get our up our lazy asses. Right, let's hurry and find Eris. Let's go inside Barrett. Oh, but we turned into cloud. <laughs> For the second time. Uh, yeah, no, that's the second disc. And you see Sephiroth walking in the distance. We need to go this way. Eris' voice coming from there. Oh, Eris. Oh, Eris, please, no. Um, here we go.
Here we go. I'm going to be a douche and leave the episode. When we get to the next save point, I think you guys know what's going to come next. We need to mentally prepare ourselves. And suddenly, this staircase opened up. Nice, 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 nice. Love. It's a lovely staircase to heaven, baby. What a crazy building. Here we go. Oh, okay, we're here. Oh, no. You know when bad news is going to happen. Okay. Oof. I'm already feeling it. So guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. We're going to do a hop, skip, and a jump, and we're going to find Eris over there. Uh, but we're going to leave that for the next episode, guys. Come back in the next episode as we continue our journey through Final Fantasy VII. Cheers then, guys. See you then. Bye-bye.